going to show you with playing cards the difference between a data analyst, a statistician, and a data charlatan. A statistician, from your perspective, is going to come up with a question. You come up with a question about my cards before seeing them. So maybe the question you choose to ask, or ask whatever you like. Is there an unusually high number of diamonds in these cards? And then, once the data are revealed, you get your answer, and you move along. A data analyst goes, I am going to look at those cards. Let me summarize them. 60% hearts, 40% clubs, that is what's here. Maybe that's inspiring, maybe that isn't. A data charlatan sneaks a peek at your cards and then says, well, let's make a test of whether you are holding three hearts or not. And then their test is successful because look, you were holding three hearts. And then they go, I knew you were holding those hearts because, and then they come up with this complicated theory. It's all academic. It's telling you how they knew all this stuff. Actually, they only knew it in hindsight. And they came up with an explanation in hindsight. That is cheating. They found the pattern first. Then they asked, is the pattern surprisingly there? Ta-da, I'm surprised. And actually, the whole rhetoric of how statistics works is around surprise. And folks, you cannot be surprised by the presence of a pattern that you have already found. You saw it once, you're going to see it again. That's how this works. When you use statistical tools on data that you've already seen before, you are asking, what is the strength of the pattern in the current data? That is analytics. You're actually not learning anything about the data outside. Because the whole idea here is, if you call your shot before you take it, you're saying, before I look at the data, I'm going to call my question. I'm making it independently of what I saw there. I'm not being influenced by what I know is in these data. So let me ask my question and let me get the answer from the data. Once I've seen the data already, the way that I'm asking the question is already a problem. I can't unsee what I've seen. And I am cheating at that point. So one way that I could do it, I could do analytics on these cards and go, ha, huh, how interesting. Maybe there is a surprisingly high proportion of hearts in this deck. I then create my statistical hypotheses about that, and then I take a different selection of cards from the same deck, and I see how I feel about that based on these new data, which I haven't seen yet. You're seeing them before I am. How do we feel about our hypothesis now? That's what a statistician can answer for you. The point is, you came up with the question before seeing the cards. If you've seen these, you might have asked about diamonds instead. Wouldn't that be convenient? Too convenient. Watch out. Your charlatan is the person who is using the same data to ask the question and then answer it. It doesn't work that way. You need two different data sets.